Oh wow. Oh my God, lazy journalism. Oh my God. Oh, that's not you can't call that you can't call that journalism. I'm making a post about that that's after propaganda. this. That's gonna be my next TikTok people. And I'm gonna make a lot of But I also want to say that the the major part that we differ on is that I don't think that everybody can do that. Again, that's why I think JD Vance is so dangerous, right? Like if everybody could do it, they would have they would have loved Pence in a, in this like weird way that they love Vance for whatever reason. That audience that he's talking to, not that uncommitted voter, the people that are already that already have his vote, they have mm. he has their vote. Excuse me. They they love him in a weird way that they didn't love Pence. And that is why it's dangerous because he can get out there and he can say his lies in cursive and they will eat it up because he can deliver. I, I, I His ability to just be a good orator on that stage and just debate he's a, well. He's a and, snake oil salesman or a used car salesman. That's I, pretty no, much No, absolutely. And everybody can't do that. In the same way, everybody yeah. can't do what we're doing. He's... Everybody can't do it, and that's why he's there. However, that's why you have to can cut be influenced through. by that. I, I see what you're saying. What when I walked away from the debate feeling like, and I don't know about y'all, but I wanted to move to Minnesota. I felt like that's what yes, tipped God. that that tipped Tim Walls over the top, in my opinion, because he had so many accolades and so many accomplishments that he could outline mm. outline versus. J.D. Vance had absolutely nothing to go on. He kept going back to Donald Trump, and then he kept on lying. You know, he kept on lying. He, what the Affordable Care Act, Donald Trump protected the Affordable Care Act. I could have threw right. my shoe at the my television. He, uh, what, what I did cannot he do? believe it. Still talking about that man. Care Act. He did try to repeal, repeal, and John McCain saved the Affordable Care Act with the iconic thumbs yeah. down on the Senate floor and then mm -hmm. uh, Frumpy Dump talked about him behind, <laughs> talked about him after he died and said that uh, he didn't thank him for the state funeral that he gave him because he was so mad about him um, uh, not uh, go, go, um, voting against right. uh, the Affordable Care Act. It is he absolutely everything, everything but that came out of but, Jimmy Vance. But I was, really, I, was really glad that, I was really glad that Tim Walls was there in order to say I was there. Right, because J.D. Vance was not there. And, and with him saying that I was there, I know what happened and things like that, that made J.D. Vance like have to turn around and rethink something because he wasn't there. And I feel like with politics like he is, I feel like he's more prepared than his person he's running with. But it's it's just it's a mad it's mad it's just manic manic it's horrible. I mean, so to wrap this up, what do you think that you would have liked to see better happen in this debate? Honestly, I did want more of a pushback from Tim Walls, especially when it yeah. came to um, school shootings, because JD Vance went on record saying that this is a fact of life, and honestly, I would have liked Tim Walls as a teacher to hit him hard where it hurts especially when it comes to that. My right. other thing is when because, it came to reproductive rights and him saying that, oh, I, I haven't, you know, I've never supported a national ban. You went on record saying you support a national ban. So I'm just confused. I just wanted more pushback on that because for those who aren't, you know, into politics or not paying attention, anybody who could have easily fell for that trap or fell for that lie from J.D. Vance because he's such a good damn sleazy ass liar. I would have liked to see um, Wall's fact check in real time. And this is what Zach and I were talking about earlier. And even just the fact check doesn't have to be the same way that Kamala reads. You know what I mean? Because again, they want to take his passion. They want to paint him as angry. So I definitely understand not giving them the paintbrush to paint an ugly picture with. I mean, but have you um, seen Tim Walls with that pig? He is so sweet. <laughs> I, I just wish he would have just, like you said, said some of those things. No. And he he did when it came to Minnesota. He spoke to their health care and where they stand. I just would have liked to see him fact check more in real time. Other than that, I think it was a masterclass in, in politics on both of their behalves. I, I do wish things that I wish would never happen again is I do feel like um, Tim Walls was a little too agreeable. I agree with Vance on that. And I agree. Me and Vance agree on that. We agree on that. We agree. It's like, okay, girl, 
not too much now. <laughs> this is a political competition. These are your opponents. Back it up. Um, I, I, I really, I really didn't like that. But 